Just give you kind of a quick history of uh, Derek Bryant. He started his career with Calumet City Fire Department September 16th of 2001. He was promoted to engineer July of 2018, lieutenant September of 2019, captain of February of 22, and he retired January 16th today of 2024. And as with every fire department, there is a proud history. Broadview is no different. Proud history and tradition that goes along with it. Derek was part of the history of Calumet City and is now it's a new chapter in his life as being the first chief, African-American chief of Broadview. As fire chief, you'll have proud moments and challenges along the way. But it's what you learned in the past in Calumet City that will get you through those challenging times. Okay. Never forget where you came from. Mm -hmm. And one final note, if I could have the members of the Broadview Fire Department, I knew you guys are standing in the back here, if you guys could come on in here. Chief Brian, I know this is a special day for you, but I want, to, I want you to take a look at these members here. These are the true face of the fire department right here. They're the men and women that put their lives on the line each and every day that makes this fire department what it is today. So with that said, again, take a look at them. They are the face of the department. They're the ones that do their job. I want you to never forget that. At the end, they're the ones that make the fire department look great, and at the end, they make you look great as well for the jobs that they do. So we appreciate it. Let's give them a round of applause once again. We got a couple of gifts here from uh, Calumet City. First off, on behalf of Mayor Jones, who was not able to make it here tonight, we got a, a nice plaque here on behalf of the City Council for your 22 years of service at Calumet City. <laughs> Along with the fire department, you're going to get, uh, retire one badge tonight and uh, gain another one. So on behalf of Calumet City Fire Department, we offer you your retirement badge. Rough ride over here. Your fire department badge. <laughs> and again, put this in your uh, nice new chief's office and never forget where you came from. <laughs> so with that, again, we appreciate it. We're going to ask you to join right at the center along okay. with the chief. And we're going to do this one again. So I'll follow you tonight. Just on a quick side note, uh, Mama Brian here always liked those uh, Air One calendars. I don't know if you guys deal with Air One, but uh, <laughs> every year, <laughs> Captain Brian would come up to me and says, don't forget my mama. She needs that uh, desk calendar. So. <laughs> and she's good for 24, I'll tell you that. Ready? You guys ready? All right, please raise your right hand. And repeat after me, I state your name. <laughs> Having been appointed to the Office of Fire Chief in the village of Broadview, Cook County, State of Illinois, do soundly swear that I will support the Constitution of the United States, the Constitution of the State of Illinois, and I will faithfully discharge the duties of the Broadview Fire Department. according to the best of my ability. 
Congratulations. <clears throat> Mayor, elected officials, residents, it's my honor to serve uh, as the sixth fire chief for the village of Brockton. Family, friends, uh, Chief Bockert, Cayman City family, uh, it humbles me for you guys to come out on this very cold day. <laughs> Chief Bakker, it's been my honor to serve for 22 years under your leadership of all my ranks, and I thank you and Chief Ben Nelly for throwing all the nuggets my way. You've always been my full support. Never shut down any crazy request I had to travel outside of Illinois, approved every request that I made, and I thank you. I just want to say that this historic moment, it, it, it humbles me. It's, it's been my honor to serve for 30 years. I've had the honor of wearing two uniforms as a police officer and as a firefighter. And my parents, <laughs> they allowed me to join the fire department at the age of 15. They thought I was absolutely nuts. <laughs> but, but they allowed me to do it. And uh, I thank you all for your continued prayers. Uh, my son, Denzel been my, my ride or die. Uh, thank you, Kelly, for all your support. And my extended family. My Kluger family is in the house. And everybody that's here, all my brothers and sisters in blue, I appreciate you all and uh, continue to support me through my journey. Thank you.